from 2016. It is difficult to overstate how bad the Democrats are and how bad their candidate Hillary Clinton is. Philadelphia, which is where the Democrat National Convention is taking place, to gather together support for Hillary is walled behind an eight-foot-tall fence around this conference center. This before they unite and declare Trump's wall will not work. Recently, Republican National Conference finished and GOP united behind Trump and Trump is on message. A delegate who professionally travels the U.S. and reports on political issues went from GOP conference to the Dem conference. He has a Secret Service clearance credential and booked in advance and made appropriate arrangements. He is conservative, Jewish, and wanted to meet liberal Jews and rationally discuss issues, something a great democracy fosters. His his plane journey was interrupted and he was delayed, but on arrival at the DNC, his credentials were taken from him and he was denied a press credential. He got appropriately upset and police intervened to move him along without his Secret Service credential. Police harass him and made a physical assault while threatening him. It could have escalated had the conservative guy not been well behaved. The Dems could have refused his ticket before he made the journey. He had gone to the DNC in 12 and had fruitful discussions with delegates then. He does it for a living, but the Dems have their wall. The Dems have police harassing innocent people so as to make sure that there is no protest against the disgraceful Democrat candidate, Hillary Clinton. Michael Moore fears Trump will win, and Dems seem to be trying hard to make that so. For some, at the moment, the sex party has more credibility.